man, this is not cool. Cannot believe that this happened, man. This brother was doing a lot of great things, man. Like seriously, like I've I've driven by his shopping center. I wanted to check it out, you know. But even if you've never been there, just hearing about the stuff that him and Big U were doing for L.A. You know, L.A. is known. I'm from L.A. L.A. is known as, you know, at one point it was known as the gang capital. But it's still known as like being notorious for that. But the thing that a lot of people don't know is that there's the gang violence was down because of Nipsey and Big U, you know, and a bunch of other cats. But these guys come to mind. They kept that violence down by putting themselves to work in different ways. You know, of course, rapping and all that, which definitely helped. But giving people jobs and making sure that um, everything was cool with, you know, even other like rival gangs or, or were rival gangs or, uh, you know, I can't really speak on street stuff like that. But this is one thing I know about these guys. They were trying to limit those possibilities of wars or anything like that and just making sure that everything and everybody was on the positive tip. I mean, to the point where YG, who was from Rolling 60s, um, is wearing red, you know, out here. <laughs> I mean, now you'll see it with certain Crip gangs, but for the longest, that wasn't the case. I know this firsthand because I grew up in the 80s and 90s, you know. Well, I'm a 70s kid that grew up in the 80s and 90s, pretty much. And though I never joined a gang, never got involved in that, I knew people that were in that stuff. And, you know, but these guys, like, seriously, they, they wanted to, you know, do something bigger that would help, especially black people, you know? And Nipsey was all about it, man. You know, I, I liked listening to interviews with him because you could see where this man wanted to go and his dreams and him making, you know, progress in doing those things and the last thing I heard he was working on a documentary about Dr. Sebi just to, to really show what this man was about to be honest you guys this might sound strange I think there was some more than foul play by certain people and I don't think those people were from you know the neighborhood I, I, I seriously I mean him doing what he is doing to help and, and, and progress and heal the community is one thing, but also making a movie about a person that wanted to do that as well in, in a different area, area, sorry, more the medical area, um, a holistic care is another thing when it comes to what Nipsey wanted to when it when it comes to Dr. Savy. <sighs> Nipsey Hustle, memory eternal, brother. I'm sorry to hear of your loss, man. This year has not been good, you guys. Memory eternal, may the Lord rest you, man. Peace. Thank you for your work, man. Memory eternal. We really appreciate your work, man. <sighs> Lord of mercy.